I'm Kelsey Robinson. I'm an outside hitter from Bartlett, Illinois. I'm 26 years old and I went to the University of Tennessee for three years. Um, I transferred my senior year to the University of Nebraska. I majored in journalism and I am currently playing for Vakith Bank uh, Sports Club in Istanbul. After World Championships in 2014, um, I went and I played professionally in China. I, like I said, I didn't know that I was going to be playing pro, so I signed in about like end of June that summer um, to Beijing. And hands down, I would say it was the best thing I ever did because when you go to China, you train a lot and the ball is completely different. The style of the game is different. The speed's uh, totally different. And I know different leagues offer different things, but for me, having that five months to just rep it out, that was crucial um, to my experience as a pro. To play volleyball professionally and to live overseas, um, you give up a lot. And while you gain a lot, I think the biggest thing that I you know, missed is my family. Um, you miss weddings, you miss, miss births, you miss um, family reunions and Christmases and Thanksgivings and the list goes on and on and on. And those things are so painful. I can't even describe to you what it feels like. You know, my grandma passed away and I wasn't there for that. And like those things are difficult, but I can tell you that when you're, it's 24, 23 and you're surrounded by a crowd and you can't hear yourself think and you find a way to put the ball down and score and you win and the girls are running around and everyone's losing their mind, like in those moments, like there's nothing in the world that can compare to that. And so I know my family and my friends, like they want me to be doing this. And those times, I always tell myself, like those times will come when I can be there. Those moments, like I'll have a million of those moments. But right now I only have one chance at this. <laughs> I think most of my craziest stories playing overseas um, have to do with being in China. <laughs> um, I remember my first year, the water in the plumbing system was pretty bad. So I would buy a bottle of like a huge jug of water purified from the grocery store. And that's how I would like bathe myself. Not a lot of things that people know, like what we do as professional athletes overseas and what life is actually like. Um, it can be a struggle, I think, in life to, especially when you're first at a new country or new city, just to get your bearings of everything. And like, how can I get all the things that I use, protein, supplements, hair care, all the oils, whatever you use, like it's very difficult to get those things here. So you have to bring a lot of it. When I was playing in China, I had one suitcase of clothes and then one suitcase like full of all the things I needed to eat. A lot of countries just don't offer what you actually need or what your like comforts are maybe. While playing overseas, I've learned that I'm stronger than I give myself credit for or that I think um, I've been pushed like beyond what I could have imagined. And I've always found a way to come out of it. And I've always found a way to like push myself. And I think the biggest thing about my career that has taught, it's taught me that um, it's more fun to pursue something in life. You know, it's more fun to like wake up every day and have this goal and this pursuit. And again, it doesn't define you as a person if you achieve that, but it's like, so worthy to wake up and you know want to fight for something do whatever it is you want to do and do it with like a lot of passion and don't worry about what anybody thinks because who you are at 10 15 20 is not who you will be so i would say if everything that anyone has to say and do what you do, what it is that you love to do